Hey everyone, this is going to be a little bit of a quick review of the game Nevmo Capsula. I assume the P is silent, um, it's brought to you by Sometimes You. Um, I'm not sure if they're the publishers and developers, um, I never got to check that out, so I apologise. Uh, but it is a really easy game. This won't be a full guide um, for the entire game. And I'm unsure because just recently I've been having issues with achievements not unlocking, not just on this game. Um, no issues with this game, sorry. Uh, just with achievements not unlocking when I'm on a second profile for some reason. Uh, so if you don't see achievements unlock, I don't know. I'm still figuring it out. As you can see, um, basically the game is like a roller coaster type game. And um, you basically go around and you use um, these things around to sort of push platforms up and down and, you know, etc, etc. Um, <laughs> and it's basically just as simple as that. Oh, all right. You can see the achievements are unlocking there. Um, so I don't know. I must have just been having issues. You can see these um, little like uh, shocking things here. They basically work as like um, ways to sort of change the. It's a bit like a train track, really. You can sort of change the direction of which way you're going in. And um, like I say, already we've got two achievements. You won't quite near enough all of them within the first nine minutes. You just have to like um, go a bit more forward in some of the other levels. Um, so you can imagine it's a pretty quick and easy game and I believe it is going to be a stack uh, for the For this series and the uh, one so you can basically, you know um, Complete it once on if you have the series X obviously if you're on the last gen You can only play the Xbox one version But if you're on the series X or the series S you can basically buy the game twice and I believe that if you buy the game twice um, For the one first for the Xbox one first it will allow you to basically something like that you'll be able to buy it basically for the for the series x at a cheaper price or something i know it's something like that just um yeah it's it's a really cool game um and um like i say it's a really easy completion uh you basically just have to go around to these machines now i can't remember what the first one's going to be um but you can see like i say we've already got like uh free achievements I'm, I'm sorry i genuinely cannot remember the uh the combination for this um, um, which is so bad, but the controls are okay. Uh, you have to use this to turn on the machine first, and then you have to type in the combination, and then you can basically just click this button over here and click send, and then you'll get an achievement. And you have to do this for like five of these machines, uh, but the literally, like I say, it's literally all done and doable in like the first nine minutes. I'm genuinely just trying to remember what the uh, first combination was, and I cannot remember, so, um, I apologize and if you just hold a you can basically back out um i don't believe i'll be able to continue no i'm just trying to remember um i think it's something to do with this here um bear with me guys okay so to my belief it's 5520 um and there's a guide from cheetah uh who basically has like a full guide for you this won't be a full guide um quite frankly because um it doesn't need to be, uh, just my simple review, and you'll see I'll get another achievement just here uh, for doing the first um, one out of five. And it really is just as simple as that, guys. You're basically just a little train guy in you know, like a roller coaster type thing. You go through here into the next section, and you'll get another achievement, I believe, um, for completing the first part of the game. And basically, this part of the game is basically where you'll be spending most of the time, really. Um, now, don't be going up that way, because that's not the way you're meant to go. But yeah, no, look at it. It's got some really good visuals. This is obviously the Series X version. Uh, when it releases fully, I will be picking up the Xbox One version. And it really is just as simple as that. You can hold X to dash, sort of go a bit quicker, really. Um, but yeah, it is. It's just as simple as that. And I think it's such a really cool little game. Um, I think as it goes a bit further along, like I say, just the achievements popping left, right, and centre, it kind of becomes a little bit harder to see a little, like, um, little guy. Um, and sometimes the, the only other thing I have an issue with this game is the checkpoints. Sometimes the checkpoints can be a little bit, um, far out. So sometimes you fall off the edge of something, which makes sense. You know, it makes sense that there's sort of like, you know, cause it like, like there's an edge here. It wouldn't make sense if there was no, like, you know, like, I don't know the word, like if there wasn't any like issue of following, if that makes sense. So I think the reason why they've done that is so that, you know, that you can't just go around and, you know, not, um, not think that you can't fall off somewhere so um and you'll see here there's another one of these puzzle type things and it really is just quite simple 
I'm trying to remember what I did yesterday. The controllers can be a bit weird to get used to. You sort of had to press these buttons, but like A doesn't work and sometimes you have to like hold A. Um, like I'm pressing A now and I can't remember. Yeah, so you have to press upwards on the left analog stick or something. Um, <laughs> oh yeah, I've not turned it on. So for some reason off is on and um, yeah, it's just, oh, what's happening there? Did I do it? Right, so you'll see that. Oh, we've done it. And then you'll see we've got another one of these puzzle type things. Uh, we have to type in a combination, but I'm not going to do it for this, guys. Uh, this is basically just my quick summary. And yeah, um, it, honestly, as much um, after this, it really doesn't go on for much too longer. It's just a simple little game. Um, it releases on the 18th, I know that. And um, yeah, um, pick it up. It, it won't be too pricey, I believe. I'll be leaving the price in the thumbnail, I believe, like I usually do. And yeah, uh, pick it up. That's all I can really say. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Also, just before I go, I'll check um, how many we've already unlocked. So you'll see we've already unlocked like six achievements. Um, but yeah, no, uh, pick it up, and thank you for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.